Hey y'all, be reacting to Habani Renmi episode 7, and as a heads up, I'll be starting my reaction from the 30 second mark in 1, 0, go! Alright, I'm hopped up. Especially after the phenomenal episode 6. Oh man, I'm excited. Now I'm gonna say Rock is gonna think if that's ever gonna happen. Oh, that was you. Oh, Saku was way too young. Because normally you'd expect to be one of the older ones like Nemu or Reki, you know? But Ku was like one of the youngest one of them all. Just got a point there. Just gotta stay strong. But I know it's easier to say. Said than done. And I kind of like how Reiki's showing tough love there. Pretty much as if she's subtly telling Raka that she can't be staying sad. Mm hmm. All in all, these sequence, those scenes were really wonderful there. As if she were telling Raka he's got to be tough for the sake of Ku. Hmm. Man, if it felt that sick when Ku happened. I don't even want to imagine what happens if it were to happen to Raka or Reki. I'd probably be balling up if that happened. If maybe balling up. Shh, now, I hope that doesn't happen to one of those two. Uh, I gotta say though, great way of starting off the episode with like a somber like tone. Yo, kind of looks like uh, Hikari's flying. <laughs> when, she's, when she's on the motorcycle with with Reki, that's a cute part on the opening there. Oh, in case you're wondering why do I skip ahead um 30 seconds right before the opening ends, it's because Funimation streaming service has like 30 seconds of logos. So in case you're wondering, since I've Seen that same logo multiple times in other animes, like Zero Experiment Lane. I just skip through it. In case y'all wondering. All right, it's back. Illness Arrival of Winter. That does not sound like a happy title at all. But it's to be expected, though. Winter can it be the illness of the mind? Not mind, but you know, just of the pain. The loss of food. Could that be it? Whoa, whoa! One of it's looking. To no. It does not look good. Hope that's not a bad sign. Hmm. Oh, the little kids. <laughs> now I understand why everyone was so happy when the. Now it's okay to cry. She has to let out her emotions. Some people grieve differently. Some people don't cry. Some people do. There's nothing wrong with that. But still, though, I like that. Trying to show toughness. Aww. And you know, it puts in the constant up. So I one white room was so happy about the cocoon because you have another additional. Additional friend. Oh. Aww. Oh. All right. If it's a month, I'm gonna assume she's been talking like that for a full on month. Honestly, is a great way of expressing how much she's missed him. Missed her. That has some nice detail in the visuals there where you see her reflection from the teardrops.
The only thing you do is just stay optimistic. Just do what you can. I like. Nemo, Kana, Rock, Aww. Oh, sure. oh man. It's anime. <laughs> it's trying to tuck on my heartstrings. It's working though. I only hope she's seen shit and that's not actually an illness, but she has to ask maybe Recky about it. But I'm not that age. Sometimes people are pretty. If it's not make trouble, they're not gonna mention anything. And Raka, we at least from what's established, she doesn't like making trouble for others. She's probably not gonna say anything. She should though. I, he should not be sorry for that. I kind of got it mixed up too. <laughs> I thought he wasn't bored. Mm. Aww. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. You can tell the compassion too, considering the tough times, even though it's not a lot, that that actually is one a bit. Oh man. This episode. It's just a feels bomb. The thing is though, some people might forget, but I'm pretty sure. Not everyone's gonna forget about Ku. I don't think the cats would forget about, even though they have such a sort of existence, or the person that Ku worked for. Huh. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, kind of extreme how just a small bit and it means something else completely. Hmm. Oh, well, at least he actually caught himself enough so he's got. Someone's attacked. <laughs> oh man. I mean... Yeah, the thing is people, when they're just prone to make those type of mistakes, and... It's honestly really sad to see Rocka like that. Kinda of strange how they're getting scared of her now. Could it be something to do with the wings? Is she getting... 
maybe it's the mental state, just the loss of, just the loss of who that's affecting her. Oh. I mean, kind of just trying to be positive, though. Hmm. Holy. That explains a lot. I mean, Rock is the youngest, it'd be kind of hard, that type of loss. I mean, she was, she's only been around for the smallest amount of time, and Rock has had off really well coup, so it's understandable that she'd be hit the hardest. Hmm. Oh yeah, that was the first time she got that beautiful outfit. She's honestly got to start talking about that kind of stuff to someone. Oh, no, 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 no! She gonna actually sit with that, that part of the word? No! I mean, I know I have to watch because I'm reactive, but at the same time, I don't want to watch that! Well, at least you have your car naked enough to do. <sighs> okay, I'm kind of glad I didn't show her try to clip off the part of her wound. That feather. Hey, I mean, that's still a talent. Oh. You know, kind of like how with those brown colors, it kind of shows off the Rocka's more dimmer personality with, now that she doesn't have the dress anymore. So I think it's some pretty good symbol, color symbolism there. Oh, I've actually wanted to see those. But she'll be willing to try that. She is at least going to be better than Ghana. Ah! Is she noticing something? Yeah, I reckon you noticed something off about the wings. Holy! I think it's more than just that. No, no. Is that a good idea, though? I mean, that's a good point, but can she handle it, though? Wouldn't it make a lot of emotional strain? I mean, it's kind of like the scary prospect of it, you know? I mean, that's true, though. I don't think you said anything wrong at all.
Wow. What the? Wow. Okay, good. Stop her from doing something crazy. So that's it. Looks like it's emotional strain. All right, that's, that's a start. That's a good question. Okay, good. <laughs> All right, that's good. So going by that, that's implying that it was emotional strain that was causing the wings to go. At least start to go black. Huh. Kind of like counting sequences like this, you can see Ricky's got those mother like qualities. She keeps on saying that, but. I'm assuming she's... <clears throat> I wonder if that means that Reiki's one of those. Wait, well, yeah, she did dream. That explains a lot. Huh. I also one that actually passed on beyond the walls. I don't know, that, that'll force himself to go. Pretty badass. Hmm. Wonder what happened.
That's for Kurame. That explains a lot. Okay, that actually puts it all into perspective. can hope they can only go away. I mean, she's been one of the most kind-hearted Hundemes out of all of them. That explains why she wakes up Billy Cranky then. There's a hope down. As sad as it sounds, I really hope she can. She can gain a flight day someday. I hope. She's got a point, this series did start out with pretty positive vibes. Hmm, that's a good question. Oh, okay. All right, this, I'm gonna give this one a 9.5 out of 10. This series has been getting progressively better, better. Right when it hit, the sixth episode, my goodness. Sirius was actually pretty good from one to five. But one six hit, wow. And I'll, and I'll give you a reason as to why I got a 9.5 out of 10, at least in my skull, for one. We're getting just more of the neg like the emotional consequences of, of a poor dis disappearance. Um, I'm just poor, poor coup, you know? And those sequences really, really, like, bring on some sad emotions, and that's why I felt this episode was worthy on that. Because in a lot of animes, when a character dies, animes usually have a shitty follow-up. They just may give, like, 10, 20 seconds, maybe a minute if you're lucky, on the ramifications of a character's passing away. And then it's like, man, if, there's a, if they just half-ass the shit, why should I care about these characters? Anime doesn't do that rushing. Here, they make sure you care. You care because you see poor Rocka crying, and you don't want to see her cry, but it's... But the writing is so good, it makes... At least it makes me feel uncomfortable. Oh, man. Ugh. Yeah, oh, and you know, it just makes me feel really, really sad to see in these episodes, but I like that because that's what makes the writing really, really good. And that's why, I gotta say, the slow start in the series really, really fits because if they didn't have those slice of life episodes where you have everyone bonding with each other, then, then those sequences would not have power, but since we had, we got to see the episodes where she spent time with Ku, all these sequences were gloriously beautiful, gloriously written. And they just make me care about every little thing. And that is why I feel this, this series has been exceptionally done in the last few episodes. Because it gave, like I gave you snippets of happiness. But no, you get to see like how in life 
at least in this series, it portrays how in life not everything is simple. And I like that bit of writing. And I love the character drawing for Raka. You're just seeing her go through the pain, deal with adversity, trying to find a way to cope. And I love that sheen, like the emotional scars she's receiving from all of this. And I also like that too, because in too many animes, you have a character, the character passes away, and then when that happens, it's as if nothing happened. But in this anime, no, it doesn't do that. So I like stuff like that. It makes this episode really, really good. It makes it stand out visually. It just makes it really, really beautiful. And then on top of that, the animation, art, and music was just exceptionally done. And that is why I feel the episode is 9.5 out of 10 worthy. It was just greatly done, greatly animated, and I cannot wait to see more. Whew. And it was sad too, and I love the details he gave on Reiki, giving her some characterization. And that's why I thought it was a masterful episode. But anyways, y'all, these are my thoughts on the episode. Be sure to comment any thoughts on how I feel about reaction in the comment section below. Rate the vid, share it, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys later if you come back for more. Because I'm definitely pumped to see what's going to happen next. And then, anyways, y'all, thanks so much for watching. Have a great safe day, everyone. Bye-bye.